Welcome everyone to Grumpot Gaming and welcome back to Lies of P. So, last episode we died. That was unfortunate, um, but we're going to make our way back. Hopefully avoiding all that. I really wish I knew how to get rid of that tower. But I just don't. There's like a path there, there's a path there, but I just, I just don't know. I have a feeling that we'll come back in that direction. Ooh. Uh, my corruption's building up. That's not good. Um, oh my gosh. I need to just get moving. I have a feeling that we'll come back. Somehow. From this quarry thing that we're going down. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Okay. This isn't going so well for a start, but... These, it's always the case, these episodes. I need to get back into the flow. Um, right. Oh, there's some stuff there. I didn't know. Oh, it's a la Oh, it's a shortcut ladder. I see. Okay, so we will definitely end up coming back that way. Right, where's my stiff? Ah, yes. That's right, I got screwed over by a... Um, by a bridge, even though I knew it was coming. I uh, very much tried to avoid it. Really? Every time. There's a shortcut there as well. So that's allowed us a shortcut to there, which we need a shortcut to open. All right, that's fine. Okay, I can just drop, right? Uh, right. Uh, let's try this again. What? What was that? Something physically stopped me going forwards. Is that just not the way I'm supposed to go? That's weird. Maybe I have to drop down from the other side. Okay, I got my stuff back. I genuinely do not trust this bridge anymore. So I'm going to go that way and maybe see if I can drop down onto something. Because I think I saw an item. Somewhere just... It doesn't feel right that I can't make that jump twice in a row when I, it really did physically feel like I was being held back. Which was very strange. Gotcha. Oh, I just... I so love this weapon combination. It's so good. Right. Let's go back up. Cross over. Because I think I'm just missing something. Oh, but that's that. So how in the heck do we cross that bridge? Because it keeps breaking. Maybe we let it break and then jump? Because it seems to just break, you know? Maybe she'll break it. Come on. What? Why don't you break it? Oh, I made the jump that time. What the hell? I don't understand. I don't understand. Radiant Ergo. Alright. Up we go. Hi. Thank you. Um. Oh, that. That. Oh my god, that is so rude. I tried to roll off that thing and it didn't. It didn't work. Um. God, there's so many like areas and stuff when I'm in them and I'm like, this feels like it's from soft game, genuinely, and it's just fantastic. I'm going to go in here and activate the Stargazer before I end up throwing myself into the void again. Thank you. Right, I want this item. This specific item. Thank you. Awesome. I didn't rest at it, did I? Just activate it, so that should be fine. Right? I mean, at the very least, I'll be able to teleport to it because it's now active. But I didn't need to rest. I just wanted it there. 
So, anything over here? Oh, a cave. Ah, but there's a box over there. Right, well, I want that. Um, do I have... Eh... Uh, oh, I see you guys. Right, what I want is these. Thank you. Oh, I didn't actually change it. My gosh. All right. Oh my god, I'm doing so much damage. I ran out of stamina. Go away. What? <laughs> That's not the rules. You're supposed to die when your health bar's empty. Come on. Okay. Bonk. All right, give me this. Yeah. Nice, a Legion Caliber, that's what we want. Right, so I guess we go into this cave then, which hopefully will take us up around the back. We can drop the ladder and then we'll make our way towards the tower. That is very much where I'd like to be. I knew it. Holy hell, okay. I'd like you. Really? All that for an attribute resistance ampule? Where? Right, I'm betting. Oh, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Oh. oh, an advance crank. I don't need advance. Okay. Vivid Ergo. Okay. Well, I'm gonna guess that it's in this direction. No! Oh, you're kidding. I genuinely thought I'd timed that and I just hadn't. Let's go here. Wait for this ball again. Go. You're kidding. That still hit me? Oh, I'm not going to catch the butterfly. I'm not going to catch the butterfly. Yes. I caught the butterfly. A half moon so Good, I actually needed that. Bye. Okay, next one then. Really, there's an item right there. Oh my god. Jeez. Where now? This way? My gosh. Has to be. Okay. Let me just, let me just grab this, alright? Chill, these freaking butterflies. Butterflies this way? Half Moonstone? Yes, good.
I think there's probably going to be a couple of guys here, isn't there? Yeah. I still love this combo. Just sweep, kill. Perfect. Oh, yes, let's drop this. Drop this now. Thank you. Ah, the tower. Yes. Thank God. Oh, it's a bit. I don't like the bit. I'm going to go and rest and then level up maybe and come back for the bear. I will get this item. I don't want to, I want to find another bear. Not right now. I do want this loot though. What the fuck are you? I don't know what you were, but you're dead now. Ooh, city long spear, blade and handle. Uh City Long Spear Stab Blade type sword, interesting. Single stab and concentrate. Yeah, not that interesting. Stats uh item uh, skills wise, but you know. Vivid Ergo. Thank you. I should definitely have enough for level up, I think. I wanna kill that bear. I'm gonna kill that bear, but I need to go and try and level up, I think. If I can. So, let's see. How much do I need? 11. Yeah, I've definitely got enough. And I think my fruit is all going to be ready when I get back. Vigor. Right. There we go. Capacity, I want to get to 25. Motivity, I want to get to 40. But really, I need to put one point in it at the moment because that would put me at 40. I have 8,000 on me. That's in... It's kind of insane amount, actually. Um, so what I want to do, I know my way around. Ideally, I want to upgrade that. Kind of. I also really want to upgrade. Um, I really want to. I really want to upgrade this. Life puppet's axe blade. I think that'd be so fun. 18.8 weight. 77.56 block. Okay. I've done some I've done some upgrading. Got some new stuff. I used up like all my money, but look at this thing. It's so huge. I bet it weighs a lot. I'm into I'm still in slightly heavy, that's fine. But this thing's damage is a lot higher. Like a lot. Like it was the handle was the blade was like 270. On, on the, on the saw blade, and this one's at three thirteen. They're both at the same level, and this just looks so silly. Boom! I've not tried its special ability yet. It's just a big, quick slash. That's that's kind of fine, actually. It's quicker than the other one, which I'd have to get both parts off to get the most out of. So I'm I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. I don't think I have anyone to speak to. So... Oh, the coins. The coins. I'll go get the coins and then we'll head back to where we were. Let's see how this new weapon fares, shall we? So we already know it's fairly strong. Let's see if we can find out just how strong. Okay, it almost one-shots those dudes. That's pretty... Pretty gnarly. Oh, actually. For the sake of losing a tiny bit of that stuff, can we put on this? Yes. Okay. More damage to carcasses. You count. Okay, that's fun. Come on. <laughs> bye bye, bear. Boom. Yes. 
Okay, Radiant Ergo, Star Fragment. Yeah, okay, I'll take that. I'll pass it. What's in the box? What should be a new weapon? I'll take some quartz. Arch Disruption Cartridge. Okay. Okay. Oh, dis yes, yeah, disruption. More, more disruption resistance. But I'm not really against disruption right now. Right now, I'm not really against much anything. Belford Arch. Uh, um, Belford Larder. Is Larder the one above Arch then? Because. I've actually not got an arch one for this. I just got an LADA. Yeah, it must be. Must be the LADA is supposed to be the next one up. Okay, well, you know what? Disruption resistance, when I need it, I've got it. Fine by me. But for now we've got this just huge, huge axe. <laughs> it's so fun. I don't even care that I've got it on a stupid little handle, it does a lot of damage. Hello? You are not a carcass. Whoa. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, I don't have any of that stuff. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Oh my god. Oh my god. Leaping amulet and a dark moon moonstone. Leaping. Let's see what that does. Leaping. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. That increases. That it just increases max stamina. Is that it? It's trash. It's garbage. Ah, typical though when I put on the uh, the old carcass thing and now we're fighting puppets again. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'll put the puppet one back on. All right. All righty then. So. Hi. I gotcha. That feels like a jump. When you say that feels like a jump, maybe... Couldn't lock on to him, which is very annoying. Give me that. Saw blade. Dim ergo. I'll take it. I don't know why I'm still getting dim, though. I mean, I guess it's a hundred. Fine. Right, we wanted that open, so we've got that open. Now we have that shortcut, too. It's not a huge shortcut, but it is still a shortcut. I don't trust that jump right now. I'm going to go this way. And see if we can deal with... This turret. Once and for all, as it were. You got any friends, buddy? No? Okay. Didn't even care about your blocking. Did not even care. Alright. Hey, we didn't have to jump. Look at that. Aren't we smart? Okay. We're making it through. Don't you break on me. Hmm. I don't trust these bridges. Hmm. Whoa, an earthquake. 
That came from the direction of Krat Central Station. Oh, this could be bad, pal. <laughs> really, really bad. Yeah, I don't trust these. I don't trust any of what's happening right now. Okay. I'm going to have to do the earthquake one on the middle of the bridge as well so they can have that really nice shake effect in. Hello? Uh, hey, are you a treasure hunter too? Strange to me someone in my line of work. <laughs> I know how this looks, but I'm not a thief or anything. <laughs> I am on serious <laughs> expedition. You wouldn't happen to know a, a treasure hunter named Alidoro, would you? I'm a big fan. Yeah, I do. I know him. I plan my expeditions to follow Alidoro's traces, but ugh, this lock has me at a dead end, and I so wanted to explore the hermit's cave. Uh, all I can do is keep plugging away. If you come back by, say hello. Maybe I'll get this place open. Life is short, and life in Krat is shorter. I reckon I should cherish what time I've got. <laughs> All I can do is keep plugging away. Okay. Talk. He's got some stuff to say. My treasure. Well, this is what I've got so far. It's a cryptic vessel. A sort of cipher device. Ooh. But I don't know how it works. I don't want to throw it away. I know how to deal with it. I think it's a clue to some stolen goods. I found it between the corpses of two thieves who died fighting over it. You know what they say, no honor among thieves. But I can't make heads or tails of it. If you want it, it's yours. Thanks, buddy. You got anything else to say? Life is short. And All I can do is keep plugging. You never heard of Alidoro? He's a treasure hunter and one of the best. And unlike a lot of the riffraff in Krat, he's not a thief. He's a pro who excavates antiquities methodically. And professionalism is important when you're talking about Ergo. Just mention Ergo and everyone cares about the history behind the ruins. That's why Alidoro has the reputation he does. The quality of his information and the condition of the antiquities are on another level. I know there are rumors about Alidoro lately, but I know jealousy <laughs> when rumors I hear lately? it. Because he's changed. The rumors? Well, for starters, they're nonsense. Alidoro is the last person you'd suspect of crimes like fraud and theft and assault. It's crazy. I've even seen a wanted poster of him. Those alchemists must be behind it. Those guys act like they own the ruins and they don't want treasure hunters to earn an honest living. I mean, come on. We're talking about the Alidoro who saved all those lives in the workshop tower rubble. So, no, I don't believe a word of it. Ugh, would you get a load of this? I grabbed it as a souvenir, but it's just malicious propaganda. You take it. Okay, a wanted poster. Maybe I can go talk to Alidoro about that? Maybe I can open this from the other side or something? I don't, I don't know, that's weird. Life is short. All I can do is... Okay. I mean, there's a thing here. That's kind of handy. I can grab this and then... I'm assuming there's a boss just past this. But maybe if I rest here, something will have changed. At the very least, I'm going to go and see if I can talk to Alidoro. I need to go back to the hotel, that's true. It doesn't say I should go talk to Alidoro. But you know what? I'm gonna do it. And then we go to the hotel with this cipher. You're a worthy hunter. Ah, want a poster. Hmm. What's this? A poster singing my praises? Not quite. Oh dear, your practical jokes go too far. A, a wanted poster? <laughs> right, yeah. Let me, let me explain. There is an unscrupulous reporter called Medoro, and he's the epitome of yellow journalism, and he only writes favorable articles if you bribe him. One time, I didn't give him a certain antique he wanted, and he slandered me, just like this. What has this world come to? Even noble explorers searching for true history get lambasted for all to see. <sighs> Perhaps I should be pleased that this scrap of paper is powerless, as there's no authority to pay the reward. You can keep it as a souvenir. 
All right. You're a worthy hunter. And that was that, I guess. Nothing else to say about it. Let's get to moving then. Ooh. He's, he has something new to say. Okay, let's go back to him. Life is short, and all I can do is keep plug. Okay, talk about Midoro. Uh, you actually met Alidoro and asked him about the wanted poster. That's odd. Alidoro and Midoro are friends. When I was hurt, he took me to Midoro, who was one of the first on the scene. Midoro is quite the medic. He saved me when the workshop tower. It's fell. not the same Alidoro. There's gotta be a logical explanation. The Alidoro I admire would never talk about a friend like that. But well, who knows? Maybe that wanted poster is real. You keep an eye on him if you see him again. Okay. In times like these, when tr I trust. Anyhow, you gave me the first. I don't know why I'm skipping. Alidoro I've had in months. Take this in return. Consider it a gift suitable for times like these. Just a little bit of demergo. Okay, anything else to say? Life is short. All I can do is keep... Okay, he has literally nothing left to say. Okay. Let's go back again. And see if there's anything we need to go to. Teleport. Yeah, just the hotel. Right, let's go to the hotel and get that deciphered. I hear there is a new guest at the hotel. And that you had a little something to do with that. I just find saving people is its own reward. I certainly don't need the money. <laughs> Even strangers. Everyone deserves some help now and then. If we who live through times like this don't live the best lives we can, we dishonor the memories of all we have lost. Honoring the lost is why I do what I do. In a way, I envy the dead. They don't have to know what it's like to remember that they're gone. Ha! <laughs> and here I go again. Blah, 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 and who cares? <laughs> now, let's get out there and save my... That is our city. <laughs> uh, okay, let's decipher the vessel. Cryptic there vessel. you are. Now, just leave this to me. Done and done. You will find Venini always seeks to rise to the challenge at hand. All right. Let's have a look. Ooh. Ooh, I, I think I actually know where that is. Old shack in the tomb slums in the mound district. Bleak tree in a laundry line. Yeah. There was a ladder there. I actually do know exactly where that is. I just need to find my way to it. Um, see what she's going to say. I know my way around it. Uh, no. Um, does he have anything else to say? Because I did actually see he said talk. Wait. About the Grand Covenant. <laughs> the Grand Covenant. You're not asking much, are you? <laughs> Very well. Geppetto himself created it, and I... God help me, I made it work. It's in every puppet. Uh, a sort of conscience. And in theory... It should have prevented anything like the puppet frenzy ever happening. It's because we don't truly understand ergo, at least that's my view. Sometimes ergo-driven puppets gain what we call awakened egos. Individuality, more or less. Which is a dangerous thing if someone's not ready to handle it. Though that is rare. Or used to be. Hence... Used the Grand to be. Covenant. Humanity's safety net. But it did not work. The puppet frenzy happened anyway. And I still don't know how. So, the King of Puppets, how did he get around the Covenant, I wonder? He used the Ergo wavelengths, but what did he do to their consciences? However, it's a different story when a single puppet cracks the safety device of so many puppets. Does the Grand Covenant break when their ego awakens? 
Or did someone cause the frenzy after lifting the Grand Covenant? If it's the former, the King of Puppets is the culprit. If it's the latter, the King of Puppets is a means to an end. I am but a simple, brilliant genius and a man about town. I do not pretend to be otherwise. That is why I'm asking you to solve this. Everything depends on what you do now and your choices. So I think it's up here. Yeah, there's the sandbags, washing line, the ladder that I never... Hi. How did you find this place? They sent you, didn't they? Those guys blabber about loyalty, but when the chips are down, they'll stab each other in the back. I don't know what's inside, and I don't really care. Take it with you and hurry. Robber's shack key? Getting involved sounds like trouble to me. You can find the stolen goods on your own. Get Any hint? Sounds like trouble to me. Robber's shack key. I have zero clue where that could be. It has to be one of these shacks, but I can't think of one that's locked. Top of my head. Damn. Is it? Is it literally this? Okay. I thought you'd at least tell me where it was, but I didn't realize it was also right here. Oh, you dick. You... You... Oh... What's he called from Dark Souls, Elden Ring, Bloodborne? What's he called? Patches. You patches, that's what you are. Oh, you're gonna die. This is where the shortcut comes in, isn't it? All right. I'm gonna use. The, oh, I'm gonna use the ladder because he's not there. All right, where are you, dickhead? Where is he gone? Life amulet plus one? Nice, an Elysian caliber. That means there's also plus amulets. He ain't here. All right. Well, dick move. Oh, I kind of wish that I saw that as a trap and I could have avoided it and heard what he said when he was like, what the heck? Oh well. Right, I guess we get back on track then. My family the plus one, that was pretty cool. I have a feeling I'm going to be fighting monsters, so I'm going to put... Yeah, there it is. Uh, so I'm going to put um, this one on. Caracas. Alright, has this dude got this open yet? Nope. Okay. 6,000 I've got on me. Sentry notebook. I don't think I have enough to use it for a level up though, so I just have to exist with 6,000 I suppose. Yep, here's the boss. Alright, here we go. Uh, could do is like open my fable. My fable not on. All right, hold on. Let me sort this out. All right. Oh, hold on. I didn't do the wish. Oh, might as well. So he said something about a giant creature, didn't he? Okay. Uh, oh wait. If it's that, that's. Oh god. It's gonna be a puppet, isn't it? What oh god, I honestly don't know. I'm gonna risk it. I don't know. It's huge. That's not a puppet. What the hell is that? I don't know. It's pretty gross. And I think it's going to be spouting corruption at me. That's like a worm face from Elden Ring, but like more devolved. 
Okay. Green monster of the swamp. Great. Hmm. Thanks. So long range. Hit it right in its ass. Come on, stun it, stun it, stun it. Phase two. Phase two, what's happening? Don't go into the puppet. But, oh, do you count as a puppet now or what? What's happening? God damn. That's really not fun. I knew that puppet was going to be something. Great. Puppet devouring green monster. Oh my god, calm down. We want to stagger this thing. Come on, guy, you can you can do it. Yes, get it staggered. Let me get round there. Come on, yes, big hit. Big hit. No, 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 no. Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. Goodbye. Yeah, count as a carcass enemy, I think. Golden Ergo, Puppet Devouring Green Hunter's Ergo. Finally, the last hero weapon is in my hands. Okay. 22,000. All right. I'm just going to talk to him first. I want him running off on I me. I knew you'd do it. I had a feeling you'd be the perfect bait. I got what I wanted thanks to you. The last hero weapon is finally in my hands. I knew where it was, but I didn't dare lay my hands on it. The swamp is too dangerous. Someday soon, you'll see. I don't like you, you anymore. You have my thanks. And you've earned a nickname. Alidoro's best bait. See you at the hotel. Thank you for your hard work. Let's go back to the hotel and celebrate. Uh, back to the hotel, he says. Okay. All right. All right. Yep, he's there, apparently. Hotel Crot. I'm going to level up first. Or should I just go to him? I'm, I'm just going to go to him. He should be here. I found the last treasure thanks to you. The Sabre. A precious artifact from overseas. It'll always remind me of the rascal who stole it, then fell into the nest. I, I tried to save him, but uh, I failed. Let the punishment fit the crime, I say. <laughs> and in a twist of fate, you must become the weapon's true owner. 
Okay. A great weapon calls for a great warrior. Show me. Okay. So it was this. Two dragon sword. Really? Okay, what's this? Fury attack dodge available. It lets you dodge fury attacks. Or we just get a sword. <laughs> Which is not at all for me. Fury attack dodge. I'm going to get it. Thank you. That's it. A great got... weapon calls... He's got nothing else to say. She got nothing else to say. Come here, child. This is my first Ooh, look, she's looking better. to get a proper look at you. It's a shame my illness kept me from seeing such a handsome gentleman. Yes. Oh, oh to be young again. <laughs> you are responsible for this miracle. You have no idea how much it means to me. I have to stay seated as I feel a little lightheaded, but I feel the vigor I thought I'd lost forever. Thank you. If Krat ever holds a proper ball again, I hope you'll ask me for a dance. <laughs> oh. Okay. I got Greet and Radiant Ergo Fragment. The Ergo is whispering. All right, anything else? People have no way. Thanks for keeping. Okay, nothing there. Right, let's go level up. I'm going to just pop that up to 36. And then I, def I have enough for another level up, which will probably go into capacity. I want to get capacity 25. All right. I don't know how much I needed. Uh, I'm just going to use one. Okay. Whatever choice. Level up. Capacity. Thank you. I need more weight. Good. Nice. Okay. Well, I am on now all out of time. So I'm going to have to leave that there. But we got through the whole rest of that um, swamp area, which was actually kind of kind of long in comparison to some of the other areas, but quite hard, but pretty fun. I, I did enjoy it. I hope you guys did too. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.